I'm Ford Cheeseman, and welcome to an introduction of Siemens Industry Online Support, commonly referred to as CIOs. During the five-part video series, I will be covering the various features the online tool has to offer, and how to properly utilize them. Keep in mind that CIOs should be your key resource for accessing Siemens technical product information and services online. In this five-part series, we will cover product support and documentation, Siemens service, the technical forum, my support, and finally, the CIOs app, which can all be accessed via the CIOs website. In part one, I will show you how to navigate to the key sections of Siemens Industry Online Support so that you can easily find your way around the site at all times. Let's go ahead and get started. First, we will need to navigate to the site, support.industry.siemens.com. Once landing on the page, you will notice a few different sections. The top right side of the page allows you to register or log in to your existing account. Just below, you will notice that there is a general search bar that can be used at any time to search the entire site. Underneath, and still on the right-hand side, is the site directory with links to the main sections, product support, services, the technical forum, and my support. This directory will be available through all pages of online support. Next, there are additional tutorial videos located behind the link in the bottom right, titled Useful Functions in the Online Support. Moving on, the News and Updates section exists in the center of the page. Quick links are located on the left, which will direct you to important sections of the site, such as FAQs, application examples, manuals, and downloads. Above Quick Links, the Product Information search bar is found. This is used to directly access a product or article page. Before diving into the main sections, if you haven't already, it is important to register for CEOs by clicking the button in the top right hand side of the screen. This will allow you to completely utilize all the features available through My Support that will be covered in the video series. After registering, you will easily be able to save documentation, file support requests, and access your product information. Thanks for listening to part one. Next we will continue the series in part two where we will cover the features available in product support. See you there.